Hey Libra, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is going to be your general reading for the week of March 11th through the 17th. So let's just jump right in and see what messages we get for you. All right, Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Wow, okay. I feel like some of you recently chose to walk away from a situation or a person that wasn't satisfying your soul, wasn't making you happy, wasn't serving you, and you recently made a decision um, to go in a different direction. And it feels like this week you are getting the perfect example of um, reassurance or confirmation that you made the correct decision. It's coming through quite clearly, actually. So Queen of Cups, Six of Wands, Two of Wands at the bottom of the deck. You've chosen to go in the direction of your biggest and deepest desires. I feel like you're going to be successful because you've stayed true to yourself and your plans for the future have always been authentic to your soul. Um, I feel like the world, Queen of Wands, Ten of Cups, Eight of Cups just speaks to what I just said where it's like you chose to walk away from something because it wasn't serving you there was something about the situation or the person or whatever it was that didn't make you feel like yourself it didn't make you feel comfortable it just wasn't working right it just was not um it just didn't make sense and i feel like maybe you were in that situation for quite some time because you were waiting for it to change or giving it the benefit of the doubt or thinking well maybe it'll get better but i feel like you chose to go in the direction that your soul and your intuition led you to and now this week you're starting to really see the transformation. You're starting to really appreciate yourself in retrospect for making the decision that you made because your world is changing and your happiness is growing. Um, so yeah, let's clarify the world. Queen of Swords, yeah. You should be thanking yourself because you made the right decision. That is no doubt. And um, some of you took a very, feels like you had an act of bravery or it's like you took a chance, you took a risk, you went outside of your comfort zone, you did something that required courage, but you didn't deny or doubt yourself throughout the process. And I feel like you're being rewarded for that. So we have strength, which is Leo, eight of wands, three of wands. You're walking in the path of your own manifestations. I feel like your connection to the universe is showing and I feel like you could be receiving some real um, confirmation in the form of communication, um, approvals. I mean, I don't know exactly what this is about for you. Maybe this is re related to your career or your relationships, but it's like the communication, the information that you're receiving at this time is providing you with the exact kind of validation that you're looking for in order to trust that the path that you're on is the one that you should be. In fact, the magician, the hierophant, and the queen of swords is saying not only did you manifest this for yourself, but it's now adding to your legacy, it's adding to your story, and it's something that you can count on. And it's this is exactly where you need to be. Where you decided to go is exactly where you needed to be and or need to be, and there's no doubt about that. That's basically what the universe wants to confirm. This is gonna be a, such a big week for you because you're not gonna believe it until you see it but it's happening let's clarify the queen of wands two of pentacles it all it all goes back to the decision that you made and for a lot of you there's love involved here this is not just a decision that you made as an individual it's the decision you made as someone that is in love with life with another person with yourself Ace of Cups, Knight of Wands, Knight of Cups. That's fire and water. That is passion. That is emotion. That is action. That is just, I mean, it's pure. It's real. I feel like this is so powerful. And I feel like you could be connecting maybe to a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Some of you could have water placements as well. And I feel like right now, especially with the new moon in Pisces, um, today on the 10th, it's like, you're setting yourself up for success based off of real emotions. I feel like you've never been more sure of something in your life before. And this is proof of that. You know, this is the week of getting true clarity on a situation that when you decided the first time around, you weren't very sure. But you took the chance the moment you got it. You got an opportunity in the recent past. And maybe you were doubtful in the beginning, but you still decided to go for it. And this is 
prove that you made the right choice because things are now making sense. Now there's a balance. Now it looks right. So I love this for you. Hope you take it all in. And if you like this reading and it resonated, please give it a like, please subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.